Welcome to the training for healthcare professionals. Let us learn about gowning and close gloving today. Let us take a look at the key learning objectives. After completing this lesson, you will be able to wear sterile gowns and associated garments without contaminating the sterile areas, wear sterile gloves using the close gloving technique. Let us first understand what gowning is and why it is important. Click each image to know more. It involves wearing a set of sterile garments before entering a clean room or other controlled environment. It is intended to cover all necessary parts of the cloth to body to protect the patient area from infection from the wearer's body or clothes or breath. It also protects the wearer from infection from surroundings. You know B complex, just gowning is not enough for a healthcare worker. Oh, really, sister? Yes. We need to follow a proper sequence of gowning. We need to wear one garment after the other to prevent contamination of the garments. That's why, might be yesterday, Dr. Mehta was scolding the new junior nurse, although she was wearing all the gowning garments. Can you please tell me the proper sequence of gowning, sister? Sure, be complex the correct sequence of sterile gowning includes hair cover, shoe covers, coverall, gown, gloves, face mask. Now, let's learn the steps of gowning. The first phase involves preparation of items which includes the following. Wear your hair cover and shoe cover before entering the gowning area. Tear the seal of the gown pack to open it. Touch only the one inch margin around the cover. Obtain and place the sterile pack of gloves beside the sterile gown. Wash and dry your hands. The second phase of gowning is wearing the gown which involves the following. Taking out the gown carefully from the sterile area. Opening it like a book. Stitching your hands inside the flaps of the gown. Dropping it in front of you. Putting your arms inside the gown. The third phase of gowning is tying the gown. It involves the following. Click each image to know more. Ask your peer to tie the gown at the back side of your waist area. Also, tie up the gown behind the neck with the help of the strings or belts given. Let us now understand closed gloving. Click each image to know more. Turn the glove package upside down and drop it on the sterile area. Pick it up at the cuffed rolled edge. Flip it over onto your right hand. Take the other side of the cuff and spread it apart and put your hand inside. Now, pick up the left glove from the sterile area with your right hand and put it on your left hand. Pull the glove over your sleeve. Wear your face mask at the end. In order to remove gowns, we need to follow the following steps. Grasp the shoulders of the gown, pull it downward from the shoulder and off the arms and turn the sleeves inside out. Fold the contaminated surface of the gown on the inside and roll it away from the body. Discard the rolled gown 
in the appropriate place. Welcome to a video on gowning. This video is brought to you by Vadwani Foundation. Material needed. Hair cover, shoe cover, gown pack and glove pack. Gown wearing. Wear hair cover and a pair of shoe cover before entering the gowning area. Remove jewelry and other ornaments. Wear face mask. Wash your hands and dry it. Tear the seal on the gown pack. Place the sterile pack of gloves beside the sterile gown. Open the pack. Touch only the one inch margin around the cover. Stick your hands inside the flaps of the gown. Open it like a book and drop it in front of you. Put your arms inside the gown. Ask your peer to tie the gown at the back side of your waist area. Closed gloving. Turn the glove package upside down and drop it on the sterile area. Pick it up at the cuffed rolled edge, flip it over onto your left hand. Take the other side of the cuff and spread it apart and put your hand inside. Now, pick up the right glove from the sterile area with your left hand and put it in your right hand. Pull the glove over your sleeve. Also, tie up the gown behind the neck with the help of the strings or bells given. Gown removing. Grasp the shoulders of the gown, pull it downward from the shoulder and off the arms and turn the sleeves inside out. Fold the contaminated surface of the gown on the inside and roll it away from the body. Discard the rolled gown in the appropriate place.